നിയമസഭയുടെ വജ്ര ജൂബിലി ആഘോഷത്തോടനുബന്ധിച്ചുള്ള പ്രഭാഷണ പരമ്പരയുടെ ഒന്നാം ദിവസമായ എന്ന് സി പി എം ജനറൽ സെക്രട്ടറി സീതാറാം യെച്ചൂരി സംസാരിക്കുകയാണ് of that country as opposed to a minority within that country so a, a majority of the country being identified with the nation the irish and the english the jews and the russians polish etc etc the majority against the minority and nationalism therefore became a majoritarian nationalism and sovereignty was the sovereignty of that nation state which even today is part of your international law your un laws today talk of sovereignty on the basis of the westphalian concept india transcended the westphalian concept of nation we said a nation is not a majority against a minority within our country the indian nationhood or this idea of india the pan indian consciousness was the amalgamation of all the distinct nationalities in india into one social consciousness of being indian where each one of these nationalities gets an equality and an equal treatment and that is where i think uh, in the constituent assembly later to be the president of india dr radha krishnan said when the whole debate was going on what was mentioned just now the debates in the constituent assembly dr dr rajendra prasad not radha krishnan sorry dr rajendra prasad said you may call he was presiding over the constituent assembly he was very exasperated and he suddenly said you call it by whatever name you want federal unitary or any other name it doesn't matter to me personally as long as the constitution of india serves our purpose now what is that purpose the purpose was to keep this huge diversity called india together in one state structure under one constitution and that purpose what you had the very very important people who drafted our constitution your ng ayengar who said india's problems are unprecedented we cannot find anything in any other constitution the american the british practice any other western constitution you can't find any any answers to the our situation lk maitra went to the extent of saying we require federalism which which defines the genius of india and the genius of india is that today you can have a barkatullah in assam a silhet muslim and a muslim from malabar in uh, kerala both being called indian muslims when they have nothing in common neither language nor culture nor customs anything but they have a an association and an identity that is indian